Alright lads, here we go with today's video. Hopefully you guys are all having a fantastic day. Today, we're doing another Bradley Bill scenario trade. What if, yeah. <laughs> If you guys don't know, recently on the channel, we've been exploring different options that Bradley Bill could go to. So different teams, different trade packages that the Wizards could accept uh, for Bradley Bill to go to. Today, we're doing the Los Angeles Lakers, Bradley Bill to the Los Angeles Lakers. Personally, I don't think the Los Angeles Lakers have enough assets to make a trade possible considering there's teams like Philadelphia or the Bucks that have more assets that they can trade. I don't think the Lakers have enough to get Bradley Beal for the Wizards to accept, but you never know what could happen in the NBA. Teams could possibly not offer up deals for Bradley Beal, and the Wizards will be forced to accept this one. That's if he requests a trade, because Bradley Beal hasn't requested a trade yet, so never know. <laughs> Real quick, if you guys are new to the channel, go down there, subscribe. It does mean an absolute lot if you guys do that. Press that red button. It takes a second of your day. Just go down there, press it, and you get two My League videos every single day. So if you are interested in My League content, go down there, subscribe, turn on the bell, stay notified. Also, like the video, lads. Helps us out a whole bunch. Cheers. So here is a potential trade package that could go through for the Los Angeles Lakers. You're going to have to give up Montrose Harrell, Dennis Schroeder, KCP, and probably a lot more first-round picks in the future. Because it's 2K, we can only go to 2025. I'd probably think that going up to 2029, I reckon, uh, is probably like pick swaps and all that uh, for the Los Angeles Lakers to get Bradley Beal to even make it somewhat reasonable. I don't know if K uh, if Kyle Kuzma would be put in this deal, but I think if there was a deal to happen, it would have to be uh, centered around these three because of salary. And like I said, you're going to have to chuck in a whole lot of first round picks for this to work. But we've got trade override here for this trade to go through to make sure Bradley Beal does get on this team. So here we go. One of the most OP teams in NBA 2K21 just got even more better. <laughs> we've got three 90 overalls. So now the Lakers had their own big three uh, around LeBron James. So Let's see how they work, how it works out. We're going to go uh, LeBron, AD, and then Beal as our scoring options. Do we have any four-star systems? We do with the triangle. We'll run the triangle. We'll see what happens. Uh, see if this helps the team go win a championship. What's, what, watch now us like not even make the finals because I'm controlling the Lakers. Let's have a squiz. We have ourselves three all-stars, lads. we got LeBron James, Anthony Davis, and Bradley Beal. So... We're doing bits here, boys. We end up going 53 and 29. We did a lot worse than I thought we would. Just going to say that. Giannis wins himself MVP, and we don't win any awards. We did a lot worse than I thought we did. You know why that is? Because we're controlling the Lakers, and the 2K isn't. So, we had three 25-plus points per game scorers, and Kuzma put up 11. All right. All right. All right. And you know it's bad when Raul Neto is putting up nine points a game. It's bad. We need a new point guard. Offensively, we're the third best team. Defensively, did the Lakers play? All right, defense. Yeah, all right, defense. And we're fifth differential. Boys, 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 boys. Because we're the Lakers, we're not even going to make the finals, are we? I told you. It's because we control the Lakers. As soon as we control the Lakers, nah. 2K's bias, bro. Bias. Bias. We don't have any picks. We have no picks for this entire rebuild. None, because we gave them all to Washington. <laughs> ah! Alex Caruso, mate. We need you back on the team. You're the only depth player we've got, bro. You're the only depth player we can afford. And uh, we'll bring in Hassan Whiteside as well to be our new starting sender, I suppose. Why not? Oh, Hassan Whiteside is our new starting... Oh, we still got Marcus. Boys, 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 boys. We could figure something out here. We've got a little bit of cap space... Hello, Drew Holiday. We give up Carl Kuzma. We go, hello, Drew Holiday. And then we go, bang, and uh, we're going to have to give up a Alex Caruso. I don't want to give up Alex Caruso, but I'm going to have to, boys. I'm going to have to. All right. Unless, unless something comes up here that I really like. Yeah, that could... That, this Drummond trade could work. Okay, we'll take Andre Drummond. We'll take him. We'll take him. We'll take Drummond as our new starting center. Uh, Wes Matthews. Can we... Can we maybe... Can we afford to, like... <laughs> yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Boban, you're also coming to the team, bro. You're coming onto the team. We'll take uh, Garrett Temple and, sure, Chucky and Tory Craig and uh, Ersan Ilyasova. Sure, mate. Sure thing. Ish Smith... 
you can come on to the... Can we afford to, like... Oh, I don't know. And trade all these players for a good starting center. Because we... No, not center. Point guard. <laughs> we need a starting point guard, boys. We need one. <laughs> Could we maybe get trade up? Ooh, that's a good start. Derek Favors is a good start. Move him to the power forward. Bada bing, bada boom. Go Derek Favors. Alex Caruso. Could we get a... Uh, Jeremy Grant, Harrison, but I think Jeremy Grant's the way to go. I reckon. I reckon so. Or we just go Dejounte Murray. Could we just get Dejounte without giving up Thingo Majigo? Because if we can keep Alex Caruso, that would be divine. Absolutely divine. No, we're gonna have to give up Alex Caruso, aren't we? Unless, unless, unless. Thank you, 2K. 2K blesses me. So we've got ourselves a starting five. Beautiful. We've also got Alex Caruso to come off the bench. Now we just got to figure out our bench, bro. We need to figure out our bench. And I reckon Matisse Tybal is going to help us out tremendously. We also get a first round pick with that. Beautiful. So Matisse, beautiful. You're now coming off our bench, my brother. My brother. Uh, could we get ourselves a, a big to come off the bench, such as Jaleel Okafor? Had worse centers, you know. I've had worse centers come off the bench. We could pick up Mark Gasol again. Right. We can pick up Mark Gasol and go bada bing. If we could have uh, given him more money. Marcus Morris, we can give a little bit of money. Mark Ace, that's Mark Uff. Mark Eve. Uh, I'm really bad at English today. I'm really bad at English. Uh, so yeah, we've got to go over here. And we're going to try. Three point guard, shooting guard. We've got two shooting guards and a center. So if we can get a center power forward somehow... I don't know how. Oh, what about a Chris Boucher? If I can get enough cap to get Chris Boucher, I will take it. I will take Chris Boucher all day, every day. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. We've just got ourselves Chris Boucher. We gave up Gogo Badazzi, Justin Holiday, and two first round picks that weren't even our own. Uh, so now we've got what? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. We're definitely good there. Woo wee. Ooh -wee. And we also get Taylor Horton Tucker back as well. So AD goes up, Real goes up, Drummond goes up, DeJounte goes up. Boys, boys, hopefully we can win the championship this season, lads. Just going to say that because I'm afraid we got gypped last year. <laughs> we got three training camps this year, though. Perimeter shoot, actually, actually, free throw camp to everybody, boys. Everybody needs to improve their free throw. And then we can go... Uh, Perimeter defense to Drummond, and we'll go uh, event offensive fundamentals to uh, Jalen Brunson. Sure, why not? <laughs> All right, the starting five: Murray, Bill, James, Davis, Drummond. Then we have Boucher, Boucher, Boucher. I don't know, Chris Boucher. Let's call him Boucher. Uh, Matisse Tybel, Jalen Brunson, Alex Caruso off the bench. We've also got Taylor Horton Tucker. All right, we've got Taylor and Horton Tucker. Uh, LeBron, Davis, Beal, we're good. We're going to run the triangle? I don't think we're going to run the triangle this year, boys. It didn't seem to work out for us last year. We will probably run a seven-second system. Sure, let's have one of the best offenses in the league. And the Los Angeles Lakers are projected one. Can we count? Mm, can we actually go one? That would be fantastic. Once again, three all-stars. Please tell me we can go to a championship this year. LeBron, Anthony Davis, Bradley Beal. Well done, boys. All right, boys. 67 and 15. Please tell... KD wins MVP. Big up, KD. Uh, hopefully, this is enough to win an NBA championship. I swear. I swear. If 2K doesn't let us win this championship, I'm going to be fuming, lads. Bradley Beal dropping 27 points a night. My boy doing bits, bro. Bits. DeJounte also doing his thing. Offensively, we were the second best team, and our defense was the best in the league. We won games by an average of 16 points. Nice. Does that mean we can... Uh... Okay, I was about to throw my control... Again, I was about to throw my controller. But we're up 2-0 in the Western Conference Finals, and we go to the Finals, boys. We go to the Finals, where we're taking on the Boston Celtics. Right. I think our team's a bit better than them. Uh, we lose game one. We are up 2-1, and thank you. We've won a championship in 2K. The first one we've won in about five videos, I want to say. First one we've won. Beautiful. We've got one more season up our sleeve as well. Yeah, no, we definitely don't have a lottery pick. I can, I can tell you that right now. We definitely don't. We 100% we don't. Do we, we need to re-sign Frank Vogel. That's for sure. 
Where's Frank? Frank, mate, you just led us to a championship. You're not leaving us, bro. You're not. Uh, Jeff or Mike... We'll bring in Mike D'Antoni as our head coach. As, as our assistant coach. Why not? Why the heck not? I don't really want to change this team up too much. Uh, Bill has declined his player option. Rah. Bradley Bill. What are you doing, bro? You just won a championship here, mate. And you don't want to come back to the Lakers. We're going to lose him to the Heat because we didn't offer him a no-trade clause. Ah! Nah, that's not, that's not on. That's not on. It, it's a rebuild about Bradley Bill, mate. We are going to make sure Bradley Bill get. Oh, he's back here. <laughs> he's back. He's back. <laughs> this time, we're not making that mistake. We'll give him a no-trade clause, and he wants to come back to the Lakers. Beautiful. Thank Jesus. Hallelujah. <laughs> Three training camps. Uh, once again, we're going to go to free throw because... I've just got to admit, everyone's free throw shot, not that great. Uh, we'll go <laughs> perimeter, actually, no, we'll go perimeter, yeah, no, perimeter defense to Andre Drummond, make him a little bit better on the perimeter, and untapped potential to Matisse Tybal. Maybe make our bench a little bit better this last season. So we're going to run the exact same starting five. Uh, we've got Matisse, Jalen Brunson, Alex Caruso, Taylor Horton Tucker coming off of our bench. I'm fine with that. We don't have a center coming off our bench. I just realized we didn't sign, re-sign uh, Chris Boucher. Sugar, can we maybe find a big to come off of our bench, please? That would be tremendous. Tremendous, please. So, my goodness, we've just got ourselves Jonas Valanciunas. I didn't expect that to go through at all, boys. At all. We just traded Alex Caruso and Oscar Tashibui for uh, Jonas Valanciunas to come off our bench. So we've got DeJounte, Bill, LeBron, Davis, Drummond, Tybal, Valanciunas, Brunson, and Talon Horton Tucker coming off of our bench. We've got to run a four-star. Uh, hey, hey, a balanced system seems to be the best option now. We'll run that for sure. And the Lakers are the projected one seed once again. Can we win back-to-back -back titles again? Three All-Stars. This three seasons, we've got three All-Stars. How about it? LeBron, AD, Bradley Beal, you boys are doing well, boys. We go 65 and 17. Luca wins MVP. We do win Coach of the Year. Awesome. Awesome. We get AD, all defensive first team. Beautiful, beautiful. We also get Anthony Davis, all NBA second team. Lovely. Uh, we do finish as a one seed. What do you expect with this team right now, hey? Hey, hey. Bill put up 28, 26 for AD and 20 for Le LeBron's. LeBron's not scoring like he used to. He's not. Offensively, we were the third best team. Defensively, we were the best team just. And our differential was the best in the league. Not as good as last season, though. So we might not even go back to back because knowing 2K... Okay, never mind. <laughs> I think we're good. I think... We're good. Bradley Beal wins finals MVP, gets two championships. Bradley Beal is now a Hall of Famer. That's for sure. Bada bing, bada boom, boys. We've done it. We went back-to-back -back championships with the Los Angeles Lakers and Bradley Beal. Our streak has broken. Our losing streak has been broken. <laughs> right, well... Hopefully you guys all have enjoyed this video. If you did, go down there, leave a like on the video. It does mean an absolute lot when you guys do that. Go down there, subscribe, turn on the bell, stay notified. It does absolutely help us out a whole bunch with that as well. We post two My League videos a day, so if you're interested, subscribe, turn on the bell, stay notified, lads. But I'm going to leave it here. Hopefully you guys all enjoy the rest of your days, and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace!